So, Eva, let's talk about mission. Impossible. Dead Reckoning Part 1. What did you think of the movie? Oh, I absolutely loved it. It was an action-packed thrill ride from start to finish. Couldn't agree more. The film's opening sequence had me on the edge of my seat. The stunts were mind-blowing. And that HALO jump scene, it was breathtaking. You rarely see such intense practical effects in action movies these days. Exactly. Tom Cruise never disappoints when it comes to performing his own stunts. It adds a whole new level of authenticity to the film. And the story was gripping. I loved how they brought back some classic elements from the original series while introducing new twists. Yes, the plot had so many unexpected turns. Just when you thought you had it figured out, it took another exciting direction. And Rebecca Ferguson's return as Ilsa Faust was a pleasant surprise. She brought depth to her character, and her chemistry with Cruz was electrifying. Absolutely. The movie has its share of emotional moments too, especially when it comes to the team dynamics. The banter between the team members, the camaraderie, it felt so real. It's what makes the Mission Impossible franchise stand out. And can we talk about the villain? Seen Harris was incredible as Solomon Lane. He was menacing and unpredictable. Yes, a memorable antagonist indeed. His cat and mouse game with Ethan Hunt kept the tension high throughout the movie. Though the film was amazing, I felt like it could have been trimmed down a bit. Some action scenes felt a tad too long. I see what you mean. Sometimes, less can be more. But overall, it didn't hinder my enjoyment of the movie. True. And the musical score was phenomenal. Lauren Balfe's compositions heightened the intensity of the action sequences. Oh, and that motorcycle chase in Paris? The combination of the visuals and the music made it one of my favorite scenes. Yes, it was mind-blowing, and the cinematography throughout the film was top-notch. Mission. Impossible. Dead Reckoning Part 1 delivered everything I wanted from an action film. It was thrilling, well-acted, and visually stunning. I couldn't agree more. It's a worthy addition to the mission. Impossible franchise. Can't wait to see what they have in store for Part 2.